Good morning guys! So I'm going to take you guys through my dorm tour today. We are currently at Tower 2 of Taylor Place. So first things first, this is the common area. We're going to get into my room last, so stick in for that. But we're going to go in here, common room, come in. door right here I have all of my okay so like out here personally for me because I my roommate moved out <laughs> so this is all my area now I have like all my shit out here which before I didn't before it was like our sharing stuff but since I don't have to share it with anyone this is what I did I have all my goals my video ideas my hopes and dreams up on these pieces of paper on the back of the door then when you pan over here there's the trash can, which has the recycle. I have like 10 gallon bags, I think, in it. Then I have a microwave, bam. Um, my Ninja blender, because I like to blend things occasionally. And then I have my mini fridge, which I keep salad, monster, water, very random red solo cup, healthy college life. And then I also have my printer right here. So this is the HP Envy um, 4520. You can zoom up on that. You can show them. Oh, but really? that is the printer I have. If anyone's curious, this is a super great printer because it has like a scanner and then it prints and it does like cool stuff. But it's like super basic and like a little bit cheaper if you're on a budget. And it does color. And the ink is not that expensive. So then down here, I just have gallons of water because, you know, gotta drink your water. Plus also, you can't, you can get water from downstairs, but like I like having it in my room when I'm lazy because you don't drink tap here. Then I have the giveaway prizes. So if you guys have not entered the giveaway and you guys wanna win, there's three winners. These are the prizes. They're all sitting here and chilling. There's a blender, two Fitbits, ton of other stuff. And, um, you know, that's sitting here because I don't share it with anyone so I can kind of like have this stuff out here. Then I have my lighting equipment, which is not plugged in because I just store it out here. You guys can see right here, this is kind of like the size of the room. If anyone's wondering what you can keep in here, um, you can keep a mini fridge, microwave, an organizational thing, and like a futon. Some people bring in like a smaller futon and that fits in here. Personally for me, like I don't need a futon because I don't have friends. So going on, just kidding. I, Going on over here, this is the bathroom portion, A, so when you have your friends over, they can see that you actually wash your hands and stuff, but um, I have the Glade Clean Linen Scent Portable on here for the grossness when it smells bad in here. Then I have Method, this one's in Sweetwater hand soap, it's foaming, so like, it's nice, and then people are like, oh wow, your hands always smell good, that's why. I have Ikea towels that are just like hand towels. I have toothpaste and toothbrush. This was from TJ Maxx, if you guys are, or Home Goods. If you guys are looking for like little bathroom things that are not gonna break the bank, go there. This is the mirror, pretty clean, not horrible. Then we're gonna get down here. So, when you get down here, I'm just gonna sit here for a second and tell you guys about it. I have my skincare, my products, my extra soap and stuff like that, um, and then cleaning supplies. When you guys are getting cleaning supplies, I recommend three main things. Dish soap, because that can clean anything if you really need it to. Um, glass cleaner, and then all-purpose cleaner. Those are the main things that you should get, and then paper towel. Paper towels, toilet paper, you know, that kind of thing. Tampons, all that in there. Then we're gonna get back up. And this is room B and that's room A. So if you guys are wondering, room B normally faces the bathroom and room A is bigger. So if you guys are picking for Taylor Place, room A is the one to get. All right, so now I'm gonna show you guys the bathroom. First, before, I just wanna say this mirror is from Target. It is a full length mirror, makes you look extra skinny because I don't know what's wrong with it, but it's a little bit like, you look in the mirror and you lose sure. like 10 pounds. Like even the Cammy knows that too. That's one of my friends that's filming for me right now. It's but the truth, it's scary. Yeah, it makes you feel really skinny. So like buy that at Target and then you'll have bomb selfie photos. Anyway, <laughs> first things first, they come with 
a um, hook right here for your towel, but you can also buy, personally for our bathroom, um, we have this hook and we got another thing for the towel rack before she moved out. So we have this one, then this is the magic of the bathroom. You really don't need that much in here. Drain declogger for the shower, the cleaner, which is a Clorox thing. Look at how clean our toilet is. Let's just take a moment, guys. That's adulting 101. You're gonna really learn how to clean your toilet because people's toilets get so gross here at Taylor. Then it has like the push button, big button, so that's cool. Make sure that you uh, get some good Charmin Ultra Soft toilet paper. The soft. Okay. <laughs> um, and then there's also a towel rack. Then I just have a big IKEA. These are the sheet towels, so they're much bigger, much longer. I'm currently 5'9", and like this goes to my ankles. Then there's this, which is actually from IKEA too. I have a bath mat, and then they come with the white liner, but you have to get your own actual curtain. And then there's the actual shower, pretty small. I'll show you guys, I'm gonna get in for you. Literally, you cannot shave your legs in here either. Just letting you guys know, I shave my legs in my sink, rinse off in the shower. But yep, there's two little ledges for you to put your stuff. This did not come here, you had to buy that. And it's honestly a piece of shit, so, you know. That is the shower. Let's go into my room. Okay, so before I let you guys in, First things first, this is room A, so this is what the setup for room A looks like on the odd side. So the rooms are kind of different, like some rooms, if you get a corner room, they have a little bit more room, like this one's kind of like a middle room, so a typical tailor room on the odd side. So we're about to show you guys my room. So first things first, I always keep my ID with my keys here because Otherwise, you lose them, and that's not good because I do that all the time, and I lock myself out, and that's just not good. Then you walk in. First thing you see are right here. I have a, another Glade um, scent thing for clean linen, and then I also have two trash cans and an Ikea little whatever it's called when you sweep. Then you come over here, and we're going to start on this side and work our way around. So... On this side, on the back of the door, not a lot because I'm a very simple person. I just have two hats. One is for Roosevelt Point, so if any of you guys know that, Roosevelt Point is a thing that the upperclassmen go stay at, and this is from Squat Bottoms. So I just have those two hats on the back. And then some people put stuff there, but like I really don't like to. I keep my door open most of the time anyway. Then you go over here. Here's the bed. It's a Twin XL. My sheets and my linens are all from Ikea including my comforter and my pillow. My pillow is actually under my bed right now. It's down there just because if I want to like make, like the key to success is making your bed in college, otherwise you never get out of it. So I like to make my bed, put my other pillows up there, put my pillow down there. And um, it's lofted the entire way. So just so you guys know, it is lofted completely as high as it can go. It can be lower, but this is as high as it'll go. Then down here I have two target things. I keep some of my shoes um, I keep my tripod because I do make other YouTube videos, so don't forget to subscribe if you guys like this. Um, this is where I keep my camera equipment, that's where I keep my supplements. Snacks are on the other one, although on the outdoor I have snacks and dishes also, I just have a lot of food. Then I have a pillow there, and then I just have some purses and like random miscellaneous stuff further down that I'll show you right here. So it just looks like that, and I have a foam roller. Then, the furniture that it comes with in here is the this, the table, and then there's also a three-drawer dresser, which I'm going to show you really quick. This is what it comes with. I put the three-drawer dresser here, but then I kept this under here because there's no reason to have it out when it works really great for storage. Top drawer is a junk drawer. Second one, school stuff. Third one is like fitness stuff. And then I actually had my mini fridge under here as well when I didn't have her living here. Like when she did live here, I had my mini fridge under here. And then, yeah, that's really all I have under here. Besides, I do also have this. This is a lifesaver. If you guys are looking for an outlet that fits on your bed and just clips, this is the coolest thing in the whole entire world. It has two USB ports and two normal ones. And it I will have a link down below. Like anything that you guys are asking me about, I'll link in the description box. But... This is super great because I can just like have a cord right here. Then 
I got my cool FitSid sign. I have these lights, which I will link. They're from Amazon. I'll link anything that's like kind of a basic thing that you guys might ask about. Those are from Amazon. Then you come over here, buy yourself some magnets because all the rooms have this and that's your AC. So like you might not have the thermostat, but I have the thermostat in here and I have it off right now, but you can control it, which is really nice. But this is where it goes out and like pulls the air in. And this is where I keep all of my schedules for my classes and like a, this girl likes to go all the way down for a squatting photo poster thing. And then, um, you know, just like things that I have going on, but you really want to print out your schedules and syllabuses. Then I have my beautiful window that literally only opens to a specific point. I also have my laundry basket down here, my backpack and my gym bag. Cute laundry. This is from Ikea and it's really easy. Okay, so now we are going to pan here really quick. Cami's going to show you guys from here to here. So this is kind of what I've covered. This is my bed area. You guys can see that again. It's lofted pretty high. It's above like right by hip level. So if you're shorter than 5'9", you have to jump to get on. Then there's my desk. This window right here only opens about this much. So don't plan on being able to get a lot of like window action, you know. But right here, I have this sign on my desk, and it just says, Namaste. I don't know how to keep the light on, so that's, you know, my current life struggle, because it just turns off. Then I have this S with the gold initial on it for jewelry. Then this was an air freshener, but I got it from someone for a graduation gift, and I used it, and it's really pretty. Then I have an iHome right here. I have my laptop. This is a MacBook like from like 2012, I think, or 2013. But honestly, you're gonna need a laptop in college, so make sure that you guys have one because they are like key. I also have my Ethernet cable that comes out over there. Like in that corner, there's the Ethernet cable, but then I have it to go onto my bed so that then if the Wi Fi goes out, like I still have internet because I plug in my Ethernet cable and sometimes it works faster. Then they have the chair that it comes with as well. Such a nice chair. Mine came with a hole in it. Um, there's my perfume, my little box that I keep my makeup in because in college, like, I honestly don't do a lot of makeup. Then I have some random stuff that I'm like doing little projects and testing food with, working on another Herbalife project for you guys. Um, and then over here, I have my tapestry, which is gonna be linked also. Then I'm gonna have these lights linked. So then I have an extension cord that's hung up with a command strip. You guys are gonna love command strips. All my lights are hung up with command strips because they're like more low key. That's all plugged in there. This is a nice little cement block. Then I have my fuzzy rug. This one was like $49 from Amazon, but it just, I feel like it completes the room, makes the carpet look less ugly. Cause um, you know, when you live in here for a whole year, you want it to look nice, but you also do want to do it on budget. Then this is from Ikea. This is just a full length mirror. They also have it in black, I'm pretty sure, or maybe chrome, but I like that color. Then this is my closet. So I bought a tension rod, hung that up like this. That's why I have curtains. These curtains are also from Ikea. Um, I'll, if you guys are really curious, like I can link it down below, but it's, they're the long ones that they sell there. Then I have velvet hangers. Those are a must. And it just looks like this. I have a blanket up there for whoever sleeps over. Um, this is like my PJs are in that. My swimsuits are in that. And then this is like more like housekeeping items. So normally I keep my like dustpan in there and stuff. But right now it's like full of other things. Then I have jackets and long sleeves that are right here. And then in the drawers I have bras, underwear, socks, shirts, and then bottoms. So it's pretty, pretty, uh full right now but it's cool and then I also have like a little box right here that just keeps like pre-made outfits so I don't have to like work too hard going to class then here I have another backpack and that's just shoved in the corner there because there is a little bit of space and gap between the closet and the three drawer and then if you guys are wondering that's my room wow that was pretty easy to go through it's a pretty small room, but it's honestly not bad at all. My rug is six by 
four, I think. I'll have it linked down below. It fits perfectly in here, so you guys can look at the dimensions of that if you're looking to get a rug as well. So that's all for my dorm tour. I hope that you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and if you guys are new to my channel, hey, welcome to the Fit Fam. I'm currently an ASU student, exercise and wellness major, and thank you guys so much for watching, and um, if you guys have any other college videos you guys want to see, let me know in the comments down below. I love you guys so much, and I'll see you guys in my next video.